probably six, seven years ago, I started using meth, and my life just went downhill after that. Um, you know, I'd gone from running 30 to 40, 50 shows a year to not racing at all for the simple fact is they weren't meth users at the racetrack. It took away the passion that I had for racing and just uh, nosedived all the way down. Um, I was making $100,000 a year, had a good job, lost all that, you know, went into rehab and got clean, but then came out starting a new life that uh, I wasn't used to, you know, after working 26 years. Had a house fire, of course, and I lost everything. No, no insurance. My family is the racers and the fans. When I come down here, I have fans coming down. Hey, good to see you back, Mike. Hey, can we get your autograph? You got any t-shirts? It's the whole atmosphere, it's the whole life. It's the sense of accomplishment. It's a sense of feeling good about yourself when you have these fans coming down and rooting for you and cheering for you. And not only cheering for you as a race car driver, but as a person. Living the dream, living the dream.